Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do a rather small haul. I cannot promise you that it's going to be short. I'm going to attempt to make this a really short video, but I tend to ramble. But anyways, let's get started. The first item is by MAC. It's not like a, it's a lipstick. I only picked up one item from MAC. It's not like a new lipstick or anything. It's actually been out for quite some time. It was like limited edition, then they made it um, permanent in December. And I just never got around to getting it. I just didn't. But today I actually finally tried it on and I'm like, okay, what was I thinking? Why didn't I get this? I like this way better than Candy Yum Yum. You those two colors are totally different. That was pink, this is purple, and it's just Max Heroin. This is probably going to be like my summer color. I can see it now. Like this and green eyeshadow. This is going to be like my summer color. My summer color for sure. It's a matte finish, which is typically what I like, but it also, it goes on, it's a really smooth matte. It's like some of them, some of them can be a bit drying and they are kind of hard to work with on your lips. This doesn't give me a problem at all. So like that. Next thing I, next um, item I'm going to show you are by, are from Makeup Geek. I've been looking, I've been like stalking that website and like looking at her products for quite some time, but I, I never, I never get around to ordering them. And finally this week, I'm like, you know what, I'm just going to try these products out. I keep hearing great things. I'm going to try it out and see. I ordered these items on Tuesday. Today's Thursday, and I got them today. It was really, really quick shipment. Like, it was shipped out yesterday, which is Wednesday. I got it today. It was just amazing. Another thing that I like about this company, which is probably going to be another reason why I'll probably keep ordering from this company, their products are from Michigan. I'm, I stay in Michigan, so I don't have to wait that long. It's not coming from California, which I hate ordering stuff that comes from California or Florida because it takes so long to get to me. It takes about five days. This is amazing. One day. Yay! Love that. So I'm going to right into it. I'm going to cut open the box. Shipping cost wasn't even that expensive. I probably paid like two something, which is great. I tend, I hate spending a lot of money on shipment, especially if it's like really affordable items because I feel like, hey, if it's so affordable, I'm I paying, you know, I find that when you order stuff, gosh, I can't get over it. When you order stuff from companies and it's like cheaper, a lot of times they like pretty much charge you a lot for shipping. So this is how the inside look, it has like a little invoice and little, those little things. They always remind me of popcorn. So I'm just going to dump those out on my floor. Shh, don't tell anyone. I swear I'll clean it up. Ooh, looking right into it, it just looks like, it looks like so much fun. So it has an invoice of everything that I ordered. So I'm going to set that to the side. Um, let's see. Hmm. It's cute. She writes a little note on there. It says, thanks for choosing Makeup Geek. So, yeah. Really excited to see what's in this box. So I'm going to go right in. I'm going to pick out the first two items, which are lashes. I've been more so into lashes lately. Like I have lashes on now, which I I typically don't wear lashes all the time. I've been wanting to try the red cherry lashes. I was going to order like a bulk of them from eBay, but I decided to get a few from this company to see how I like them. So I ordered the number 43, which is really dramatic. Very different than what I would typically go for. And then the other one I order is the number 110. And they're human hair, which I think is pretty cool. They won't, they're not as shiny. I love how I love how those are spread it apart. They look really nice. And those were $2.50 each, which I thought was great. Okay. Then I'm gonna take this out and it has like my shadows and stuff in there that I ordered. And let's see. I like how it's wrapped in bubble wrap. You don't have to worry about anything being shattered when you get it. So I ordered some, some pan eyeshadows as well as pigments. I'm going to show you the pan eyeshadows first. The first one I order is Mermaid. And it's just a really pretty, I don't know, like a really pretty like green. Like, it kind of like, reminds you of like a mermaid's like tail, how it would look. So that's how it looks. It looks really pretty. I want to see the size of these. I don't know, maybe compare them to MAC. So they're about the same exact size as a MAC shadow. So you're getting like the same amount of product. I mean, same amount of product. The only thing is these were $5.99, which is a lot cheaper than the pan from MAC. But just to show you, open up my Z palette and just compare it to the MAC shadow. Okay. 
looking. So this is a MAC channel. And this is Make a Beak. I think they're about the same size. Well, you know, it's a tad bit bigger. And but anyways. So that's the color. I guess I'll swatch it real quick. <gasps> wow. So pigmented. I think I'm gonna wear this color tomorrow. Oh my gosh. I am like so excited. I'll probably definitely order more of these. I'll give you guys a more like maybe a review later on or review video later. So I'm set that to the side. I'm gonna show you the other colors. I'm not gonna swatch these because it would take all day and like I said, it's a quick video. So you have this really pretty gold color, which is called Gold Digger. It's just a really pretty gold. The next color that I got is Drama Queen, which looks like this. The packaging on these alone are beautiful. But this is a really pretty purpley color with sparkles in it. Look at that. It's so beautiful. The next one is a color that I thought would be great for, for the transition, and it is Creme, Creme Brulee. I don't think I have a color like that. I may. Let's see. No, I don't. I was looking at my Mac, Mac, Mac shadows. But it's really beautiful. And the last pan shadow that I got is Cocoa Bear. Which is a really pretty cocoa color. It's not as dark as I envisioned. I envisioned it being something I can use for my brows, but it's not. But it still looks really pretty. So, And it's a matte shade, which is typically what I like. And the next I have three pigments. And the pigments were, let's see, the pigments were $6.99 each. And again, great packaging. And this one that I got is called Liquid Gold. Let's see. So this one's called Liquid Gold, and it's a really pretty gold color. I'm going to open this really quick just to show you guys. Hope it doesn't make a mess. See. Oh look how it says make a beak on the top. Just so you wouldn't expect this great of a presentation from a product that's so reasonably priced. Let's see. Whoa, okay that can be messy. I'm gonna show you the top because I don't want to spill this. Oh my god, that's so beautiful. So that's the color. Which looks like, like it says, liquid go. Oh, okay. You ready? Oh my gosh! Oh my god! Oh my gosh! Just putting this on, it looks like I'm applying it wet, but I'm not. O M G! Like seriously, it's just. Look at that! Like. That is so crazy, and it's not even showing up on camera. It's so freaking intense. <gasps> oh my gosh, I'm like about to faint. It's amazing. It doesn't come with a sifter. It actually looks like that, and it's pretty full. I bought a set of sifters, so I will show those to you. Because other than that, this is going to get messy. I can see now that this is going to get messy. Okay, so the next color that I got is Utopia. Utopia looked really pretty. Um, I actually Googled this one, this particular color, to see how people wore it. And I just thought it was a very unique color. Nothing that I've seen anywhere. I guess I'm being like excited, like, whoa. Okay, so this is pretty much a glitter, not a pigment. Oh my gosh, look at that. I'm like, is that not pure awesomeness? Like, do you see that? Wow. Oh my gosh, and when you touch it, it's weird. It's like, it's not what you would expect when touching it. It feels like bouncy. It feels really bouncy. It's like a glitter, but as you rub it, it breaks up. That's how it looks. 
That is pure gore. Just gorge. Okay, <laughs> one more. The next one is Nightlife. I wanted, I wanted to get this other color, but they didn't have it. It kind of reminded me of Max Club or like the blue brown pigment. But they were all out of that one, and I wanted to get another one, so I got Night Night. What is it? Nightlife. And I don't know. The reviews were good. Nice. It said you know that it wasn't what they expected when they got it. It was way better. So I was like, hey, why not? You get so much product in this. I feel like this will last forever. Okay. Not expecting that. It's actually, ooh, don't worry, I didn't spill anything. It's actually really pretty, like, mauve glittery pigment. Oops, let's see. Okay, I am making a huge mess. That's like a huge mess. But this, oh, it is beautiful. This will go great with a lot of colors from the the Naked 3 palette. That's how it looks. That is beautiful. Look at that. Pigmentation is amazing. And the last thing I got, like I said, was some shifters. Just to prevent me making a mess as big as the mess that I'm making right now. So... They come in a pack of three. They were 75 cents for three of them, which I thought was, no, not three. I got five. I guess I need to order me <laughs> two more pigments. And they're just like this. Just little shifters that you stick in the pots. So that's all, guys. Let me know what you think, and I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.